This is the 134th launch of the Space Shuttle program, the 25th launch of Space Shuttle Endeavour, and the 36th flight to the International Space Station. Endeavour will deliver the Alpha Magnetic Spectrometer, called AMS-2, a particle physics detector designed to search for various types of unusual matter by measuring cosmic rays. Its experiments are designed to help researchers study and look for clues to the formation of the universe. Endeavour will also bring up to the station the Express Logistics Carrier 3, an external platform for the space station that holds large equipment that will carry spare parts and equipment to sustain the space station's operation in space once the last space shuttle flight has occurred this summer. Endeavour Launch Director, Air to Ground One. Go ahead. Okay, Mark, looks like a great day to uh, launch Endeavour for the final time. So on behalf of the thousands of proud Americans who have been part of her journey, good luck, Godspeed, and we'll see you back here June 1st. Thank you, sir. Uh, on this uh, final flight of Space Shuttle Endeavour, we want to thank all the tens of thousands of dedicated employees that have put their hands on this incredible ship and dedicated their lives to the Space Shuttle program. As Americans, we endeavor to build a better life than the generation before, and we endeavor to be a united nation. In these efforts, we are often tested. This mission represents the power of teamwork, commitment, and exploration. It is in the DNA of our great country to reach for the stars and explore. We must not stop. To all of the millions watching today, including our spouses, children, family, and friends, we thank you for your support. Go from a to start. Eight, seven, six, four, three, two, zero, and liftoff for the final launch of Endeavour, expanding our knowledge and expanding our lives in space. Houston Endeavour, all program. Roger roll, Endeavour. Houston is now controlling. Endeavour beginning to over onto its uh, back, the roll program underway as uh, Endeavour begins a heads down position on course for a 51.6 degree, 136 by 36 statute mile orbit. Okay, Ohm's burn starting in five seconds. About now. Here we go. Here we go. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> that's a real Here burn. It's a long burn. We can oh, do that again. You're right. There it goes. There's, yeah, that's like a tenth of a G. Right, where's your other boot, by the way? It's tied off. <laughs> hey, we're trying to work down here. <laughs> that's a good. Well, that's a good. Uh, these tenth of a G. Wow. Wow. Okay, we're gonna open the payload bay doors now. About nine seconds. I see now, good. Now the forward, forward, forward and aft latches. latches. Yeah. So far so good, Mark. All right. One time is the time as you expect. Another 15 seconds, Spankage. And you always keep track of the big switch. Right? Yes, I am I have my eyeballs on it and my fingers can get to it. There we go. Start of payload bay door opening. It looks like a dual motor time.
increase the sunshine. All right, here we are in the flight deck of Endeavour, flight day one, recently in space. Sorry about the cloud deck when we took off. <laughs> We're really excited. It's great to be up here. Yeah, it was a spectacular ride. I couldn't see anything but the lockers, but it was still a lot of fun. <laughs> no master alarms. I'll have to say it was uh, a lot different than uh, flying on the Soyuz. Hey guys, here we are, Roberto and I. We're on the mid deck. We're setting up uh, Gira, which is our water purification system over here. And uh, we've been in space now for what? Four hours? Five hours? Something like that. And um, amazingly, we're all feeling great. It's, uh, this is awesome. I just I can't wait to get back to the space station and uh, feeling just awesome. Can't wait to get Roberto? Outside. My first ride on the shuttle was an uh, amazing launch. And then Nico. Uh, I was a little afraid but uh, got quickly adapted and uh, uh, it's very interesting to work with uh, old shallow systems and I need to say that uh, it's easier here in microgravity than it was in the, in the, during the training floor. Most of the, most of the equipment here just makes sense. It's, uh, it is very intuitive and uh, happy to be here. It was a great ride up. It was an awesome flight up. You're upside down. Hey, didn't I see you up here last time? <laughs> you were upside down last time you're, too. You're still upside down. Oh, you're upside down. Cheers.